97 Sports, sponsored by Isleta Resort and Casino. Welcome back, Bethany Miller here live outside of the historic pit and this arena has been the place to be in the month of January. Just three days ago, the UNM men's basketball team hosted 19th ranked San Diego State and using a strong second half, the Lobos were able to finish and send the Aztecs home packing with just the team's third loss so far this season. The win came at just the right time too, because behind me in this packed arena, Richard Patino's squad is hosting yet another top 25 opponent. 16th ranked Utah State is here in the Duke City. The Aggies on a 15 game win streak coming in. That is the longest current active win streak in the country. New Mexico hoping to do what no other team has been able to accomplish in 30 years and that's beat back to back ranked opponents. And let me tell you by the looks of the fans, the thousands of fans inside right now, you would never have guessed this is a Tuesday night conference game. Luckily for the fans though, the Lobos picked up right where they left off against the Aztecs. A big factor in tonight's first half was the emergence of Nelly Jr. Joseph on offense against San Diego State. He had just two points the entire game tonight. Junior Joseph 16 points in the first half alone. The Iona transfer would be the only Lobo player to score in double digits in the first half. And speaking of 16, that would be New Mexico's largest lead tonight against the 16th ranked Aggies. 55 39 the Lobos lead at halftime. So here's a look at where the game currently stands in the second half. Utah State has chipped away at that lead. The Aggies are currently within 10 against the Lobos. There's 11 minutes and 16 seconds left in regulation here tonight. Nelly Jr. Joseph up to 20 points. JT Top in the Mountain West Freshman of the Week has 12, while Donovan Dent has 11 points points. This game will certainly go down to the wire. Of course, it's always fun when the Lobos enter 9-0 at the pit. Now, this is the final home game for UNM before they hit the road for their next two conference games this weekend. UNM travels to face Air Force, while then they travel to California next Wednesday night to face San Jose State. I'll have a full recap of this game as well as post-game reaction tomorrow on KOAT Action 7 News at 6. Until then, though, live here outside of the pit for KOAT 7 Sports, I'm Bethany Miller. We'll be right back. KOAT 7 Sports is sponsored by Isleta Resort and Casino, where the fun begins.